Well, we're best pals, so we, we do a lot together. And he's a bit of an old soul in a puppy's body. Chicago is just over a year, uh, and he was born into a South Korean dog meat farm. Humane Society International reached out to the Potter League, asked if they would be willing to take some of the dogs. They said, of course. It's so heartwarming to see him actually have a chance at, at a good life. Well, I think animals are important to people. The connection we have to them is important, and the Potter League is here to support that connection. We want to promote the human-animal bond and keep it together whenever possible. So whenever we see if that bond is at risk of being broken, we want to be there to prevent that from happening. We want to educate people from the very beginning about how to have a successful relationship with people and animals and protect both of them. Our outreach is a really important part of what we try to do here at the shelter and this year we really spent some time getting uh, more organized and pinpointing the areas that we felt um, were most in need of our help. So the wellness clinics are something that we've set up for the local community where they bring in their pets and I do a free exam and uh, we give them vaccines and if there are any problems that we can't take care of here at the Potter League then we'll recommend that they go see a local veterinarian. The amount of animals that we are taking in and adopting out has increased significantly and I think we're getting more efficient about getting it done and I think having a veterinarian on site is a big part of that because we're not waiting for blood work results, we're not waiting for procedures to be done. We can get that all done very quickly so we're able to process more animals and I think that's a huge change. Some shelters wouldn't put the time and effort into an, a senior dog. They would probably put them down or euthanize them because they didn't have a chance, but they give them a chance here. And I love that. And they are such good pets, such good companions. One of the main reasons that held me up from volunteering here was I thought I would want to adopt all the animals. But the thing I found was that it's a really great place for animals to be. So you don't feel sad or bad about leaving and leaving the animals here because they're in such great care. The facility is amazing, the staff is amazing, um, they're well loved, they're well cared for until they go to their next place which will ideally be their forever home. And it's something I don't get to see week to week, how happy people are and how much joy this small animal has given them and knowing that a lot of the best parts of their days in the future are going to include that animal always liked Abyssinian cats. So when we saw that Potter League had Abyssinian kittens there, we had to find out why. They were seized from a house in Newport, uh, which had uh, about 18 cats total from a horrible boarding situation. To be honest, it's something I don't, I don't really like to think about too much. From what we've seen and heard of the condition of the house, I mean, it was in complete squalor. I mean, the, the place was one big litter box. I just want to say thank you, really, to, uh, to Potter League for the amazing work they've done with these cats, as well as everything else that they, they continue to do. I, I wouldn't have wanted to see those cats when they first came in, but to see them come out, um, they're, they're perfect. They're, they're absolutely perfect. I, I couldn't have picked three better cats for our family to, to have. I'm going to be 76 this year, and I have no intention to retire and because I'm lucky enough to come to my job and enjoy my job. When I first started 31 years ago till now, all the different changes, which are all for the better, I mean, it's just great. We're very lucky that we have the staff that we have. It's our own little community here that is helping the community out there. The community is always there for us. The animals keep us all together, to, trying to do this, the right thing for them and to help each other in the community. We're fortunate to be on this island and in Newport County and to have people that really support us and are there anytime we ask.